this short video, I'd like to show you how to graph the revenue and cost curves that will appear like the ones in your assignment. First of all, step one, you want to find the total cost. When you're given the quantity of the good that's being produced and the fixed cost, which are 10 at every price, uh, at every output level, your total variable cost. Simply to get your total cost, then you're going to add your fixed cost plus your variable cost. And you can see that I have now calculated the total cost by adding fixed cost plus the variable cost together. The next step then is to find total revenue. I assume that the price of the product was 10 for an easy calculation. So I simply took 1 times 10, 2 times 10. So now I have my total revenue uh, calculated. The next step then is to find my profit. And the profit's pretty easy to calculate. You take your total revenue minus your total cost. So you can see I'm in the hole there. And then I'm gradually digging my way out of the hole. Profit is maxed at seven units. And can I also point out that the firm, if all they care about is maximizing profits, would make seven units. But if they also found themselves with fixed costs that they wanted to minimize, um, you would find that they would be better off producing than shutting down because even if they produced one unit, they would lose less than if they shut down. The next step then is to use your graphing software to create your graph. And how I made this graph will follow on the next video. Hello. I'm going to show you in this video how to make a graph from data on the screen. First of all, select the data that you would like to re uh, make a graph out of, and I've done that, starting with quantity, total fixed cost, total variable cost, total cost, and total revenue. Then I'm going to find the chart wizard key. Click on that. And for this one, I would like to make an XY scatter graph. I prefer this one on the right to this one since uh, the markers clutter up my graph too much. So I'm going to click on that. Now I have my curves and my legends over here. If you want to identify your legend, then simply click on your series key. The first series key then will be total fixed cost. The second curve will be total variable cost. The third curve will be total cost. And finally, series four will be total revenue. Click Next. And let's give this a title. Let's just call it Sample. On the x-axis, we have quantity. On the y-axis, we have costs and revenue. Then let's get rid of the grid lines. I think they make your titles or make your graph look messy. And so there, there's your uh, graph from the data. Click Next. Finally, let's finish it. And as you can see there, now we have a graph for this project. I also like to make it um, a little bit cleaner by getting rid of the area and the border. And so there's a slightly better graph if you like to look at it like that. And if you like to make your line sticker, just double click on them and go down there. I think a thicker line shows up better on the screen. And I don't really like that color there, so I'm going to make it orange. And then I'm going to just make it a slightly di different color there. And then finally for our total revenue curve. And Let's make total revenue green. And then let's just go down here and make it just a little bit stronger. So uh, there is your graph. And the one for your assignment will be done just like that.